everybody this is Nora and on this video I am going to attempt to capture um, the filing of my nails and bringing them into a different shape as you know if you've seen a few of my other videos I have been wearing this um, going with this shape for quite quite some time now after being with my pointy stilettos or mini stilettos for some time I do like to change every once in a while so and you're going to notice that this is since I do keep a gel overlay um, one of my other jobs to do is to go ahead and do a, an infill or backfill or refill of my gel overlay so I have already filed off um, pushed back my cuticles filed off the um, lifting and did some buffing so in the next step now instead of jumping into the filling because I do want to reshape my nails I want to go ahead and do that before doing the filling of the gel and some of you have asked to um, see how to do that so I'm going to attempt to capture that on video this will be I'm not sure how difficult that's going to be but this is my new shape now and this is on my right hand that I already did Hopefully you can see that and I have a black background here that will help um, one of the things that I do is that's speaking of um, this background or the towel a black towel I like working over a black background not only will this towel will be nice for keeping or picking up the dust and keeping it in place and not going all over my my desk um, but I like to use it as a because um, when I, as I'm looking at the the shape of the nails it makes it easier for me to to be able to tell um, how straight my or how well I'm doing with the shape versus having them against something white or up in the air and then it's kind of difficult to tell which way I'm going when I'm when I'm reshaping so I hope that makes sense so I'm gonna go ahead and jump on that and I hope you guys enjoyed this video Oh, by the way, I did forget to mention that the nail files that I have here that I'm going to use, I have a couple because I switched just for comfort. I like to switch back and forth. But this one here is a 100-180 grit. This 100 on this side. I'm sorry, this is the 180, which is smoother, and the 100, which is the rougher on this side. This one is... 180 on both sides so it's a bit smoother and I just go back and forth between the two and then of course to brush off the dust in between I use this cuticle brush
guys, so there was the messy job of reshaping my nails into this shape. This is actually my most favorite shape, um, but it, it, it does take a lot of maintenance on keeping the shape because obviously as your nails grow out, they naturally tend to be more square and then you have to continually keeping this shape every couple of weeks. So that's it, and then my next step is going to do the, the infill of my gel. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more videos and tutorials, and thank you for watching.